everyone. Thank you for coming today. We are doing a Prime Gets Fit yoga video, basic yoga today. Uh, focus is neck, shoulders, and low back for you all that sit at your desk a lot. My name is Johanna. I'll be your instructor. I'm so glad that you're here. So let's start on our feet in our mountain pose with our hands to our sides, opening the hands up, roll the shoulders up and back, okay? Do another shoulder roll up and back, then inhale, arms coming all the way up, reach way up and stretch. Now lift your heels just a little bit so that you're on the balls of the feet. Exhale, lower those arms and another big shoulder roll around. And inhale, arms up, good. We're gonna sweep the arms through, sitting back into a chair position. Then sweep, inhale, arms up. Exhale, fold over, dropping the head, okay? Put your hands on your shins and lift your chest to a flat back. Deep breath in and exhale, good. Inhale, arms all the way up again, reaching. Lace the hands together and lift, reaching up, stretching through your whole body. Lift your chest, good. Lower the heels, sweep the arms through to chair, sitting back. Good, inhale, arms up. Exhale and fold over. We're warming up the body. So I need you to breathe. Inhale to flat back. Exhale, fold over. Inhale, coming up. Warming the body. Exhale, sweep the arms through to chair. Keeping the back straight. Lift the arms up, inhale. Exhale and fold over. Hands on shins, lift the chest. Feel the length in your spine. Good, fold back over. Inhale, arms up. One more time, reach through, chair position, and back up, and fold over. All right, hold here in your forward fold, drop your head, let your low back stretch out, feel the length in the back of the legs. Good, now come back up to our mountain position. Good, roll your shoulders up and back. Again, up and back. Big shoulder roll. All right, lift that right arm up and bring it over to the side of the head. I want you to just tip your head over and then turn your eyes and look down toward your armpit. This is for your neck. Good. And then switch sides. Other arm up, take it over, turn and look toward, toward the floor. Good, and up. Drop the chin down, and then lift the head straight up. Drop it down, and up. Just warm in the neck, one more. Down, and up, good job. Inhale, arms up. Sweep the arms through, chair position, looking up. Good, sweep the arms back up overhead and fold over. Now we're gonna lunge the right leg back. Now, hand close to the foot here in front. Twist towards your front leg. Good, opening this up. Lower the arm. Step back to downward facing dog. Lift the hips up. Look at your hands, they should be shoulder width. Your feet are hip width apart. Press those hips up. Good, come forward to a plank position. Then we're gonna lower all the way down to the ground and lift the upper body up, good, lower, inhale, lift up, roll the shoulders back and down, and then lower, good, tuck your toes under and press back to downward facing dog, lift your hips up, again, your head is right between your arms, and lower your heels, good, lunge in with the right leg, and twist, looking up. So we're revolving our chest toward the ceiling. It's a nice stretch for the body. 
Lower the arm, step your back foot in. Come to a flat back and deep breath in and out. Good job. Inhale, coming all the way up again. We're gonna do another chair position, reaching through, sitting back. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, folding over. Step both feet back to downward facing dog. Good. Come forward to a plank. Now this time we're gonna drop into a crocodile, nice and easy. If you need to, use your knees. Inhale, upward dog. Good, exhale back. We're gonna do that again. So I need you to come forward to plank, tummy nice and tight, and then lower into your crocodile using the knees if you need to, and then press up and through, lift through the chest, exhale back. Good job. Lunge your left leg in, lower your back heel, and lift to warrior one. Okay, here we are in warrior one. Your back heel is on the floor and you're pivoting the back foot. Good, now open this up to warrior two, holding, and breathe in and out. Reach up and stretch through the ribs. Reverse warrior. Come back to warrior two, holding. Breathe in and out. Bring your back arm around and lower your hands. Lift your back heel and step in. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, now just bring your hands to your thighs and sit back. Good, now fold over, lengthen your legs lunge your right leg back left leg back lower the heel lift to warrior one coming up looking up swing the back hip around to the front good warrior two holding inhale exhale reach up reverse warrior are good stretches for your whole body. Holding again, warrior two, shoulders over hips. Take the back arm around, lower the hands and lift the back heel. Take the front leg back to downward facing dog. Come forward to your plank position. Lower again into your crocodile. This works our strength. Inhale, upward dog. Exhale, press back. Lift those hips up and breathe. Inhale. Exhale, one more deep breath, in and out, good. Lunging the right leg in, step your back foot in. Come to a flat back and hold. Inhale, arms all the way up. Press up, lift those heels, stretching through the whole body. Nice little arch in the back, so tip back just a little and feel that length. Good, lower your heels, lower the hands to mountain, and a shoulder roll, up and back. Again, up and back. All right. We're gonna take our feet to a wide position, and we're gonna turn this foot this way, and sink into warrior two. We've done this before. Holding. I want you to hold your warrior two. Nice long arms. Breathe. Inhale. Exhale. Now take the arm to the thigh and reach up over, looking up. Holding. Good. Back up to warrior two. And then we're going to do that reverse warrior again, reaching up and pressing back. Feel the work in the legs. Good. Lower and hold. Come to the center. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, fold over. All right, let your head drop. Pull this in your legs, the back of your legs. Good, and your low back. Deep breath. Good. Now circle arms up overhead again. 
and then turn the other way for warrior two. So the back foot cuts an edge here and the front foot points right ahead, looking down your hand, coming over, reaching, extending, Good, deep breath, back up, warrior two, shoulders right over the hips. Lift that front arm up, reaching, holding. Good, keep breathing, back to warrior two. Come back to the center, inhale, exhale, folding over again, drop your head. Good. Walk your feet in to the middle front mat. Inhale, come up. You can use two mats if you like, or one works just as well. Hands here to your heart center. Lower the hands to mountain position. Circle the shoulders up and back again. Reach it back. Hold your hands and open your chest. Now fold over, bringing the arms up. You can feel a nice shoulder stretch here. And then come back up, breathing, holding, open your chest. We need to get our, our fronts open. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, circle arms through to chair. Inhale, back up and fold over. Lunge your right leg back. Now we're gonna lower the knee in the back, lift, Hands up and press back. Good, we're stretching the hip flexors on the right side. Good, lower, lift your thigh, and then I want you to twist again toward the front leg. And then lower the hand. Good, step back to downward facing dog. Working on our strength again, come forward to our plank position, dropping the knees if you need to, lower into crocodile with an exhale, then inhale, upward dog, good, exhale back, nice. Plunge the right leg in, good, and lower the back knee, lift, pressing into that left hip, right here in front. Stretching those hip flexors. When we set a lot, those get very tight. Good. Now lower the hands, lift your back thigh and twist again toward the left leg. Good, lower. Step back to downward facing dog. Come forward to plank. Again, lowering, upward dog, good. Now. Drop the knees, and I want you to sit back. Sitting back into child's pose. Hips lowering, reaching out with the arms in front. Lower your head to the mat. This is a wonderful back stretch when your back is tight. This is a great stretch for that. Good, it also stretches through the shoulders and the upper back. Now I want you to come up to hands and knees. We're gonna arch, we're gonna cat curl the back all the way up, and then we're gonna lower it all the way. Good. Inhale as you lower. Exhale, arch up. And lower, good. Tuck your toes under and press up and back to downward facing dog, lifting the right leg up, pressing it all the way up. Circle the leg, tiny circles. Then circle the other way. Good, lower the leg. Lift your other leg up all the way. 
and then tiny circles and then go the other way good lower the leg that helps to relax the hips so we can stretch it good let's do another half series here plank position lower crocodile upward dog always working on our strength exhale back downward facing dog and lunge in with one of your legs now we're going to lift to a high lunge holding good lower the arms reach back open your chest up then tip forward Good, come back up, lift the arms up, lower the hands, step back, and lunge your other leg in, and lift. Nice and tall through the body, pressing back, lower the arms, reach back, open your chest, tip forward. Good, come back up, inhale, arms up exhale lower arms step back to downward facing dog and let's just run the feet up and down kind of loosen up the lower leg and the hips good walk your feet in all the way in come to a flat back deep breath in and out good inhale arms up Exhale, hands to heart center. Come back to your mountain position. Roll your shoulders up and back. We're gonna take this leg and cross it over. Then you're gonna lower your seat as far as you can. Lift the arms up, reach out. Take the same arm that the leg is crossed and wrap it underneath the other arm. Hold here. Now if the balance isn't there, just place your foot down by your other foot and do the arm. This is stretching through our upper back, the arms here. Good, release, inhale, up, exhale. Cross over the other leg and then lower your seat. Good, inhale, arms up. Exhale, reach forward. Take the arm underneath, the same arm on the leg that's wrapped over. Lift the elbows up, stretching through the upper back. This is eagle. Good job. Inhale, lift the arms back up. Take a a little bit of time here to lift through the body lift those heels up lower the heels reach through chair position holding the abs in good back up and fold over good job step back to downward facing dog lift up your left leg now we're going to take the left leg through like so and lower the left hip foot is flexed in front to our pigeon position this is for the hips now if you want you can reach forward we're going to hold this position and breathe stretch your back leg back as far as you can all right good I want you to come out of this and step back to a downward facing dog and then we're going to do the other side so bring the other leg in flexing the front foot lengthening your back leg and you can stay up if you want 
or you can fold over. Either way, we're working on the hip. The hips get tight when we sit a lot, so we need to stretch them out. Good job. Deep breath in. Exhale, step back to downward facing dog. Good. Now lunge in with the left leg, and we're going to come as low as we can to the inside of the leg. This is also a hip stretch. You can take the other elbow down, or you can be on your hands. Either way, I need you to come as low as you can, working into that hip. Good job. All right. Now come to a lunge again, right here. Then step the back foot in, and lower the body on the front leg. Stretching the front leg in the back. One more breath. Good. Step your back leg in. Lunge back with the first leg. And then come low to the inside of the leg. Stretching out the hip on the other side. Breathing, deep breaths. This can be very intense, and so you need to work with the poses with your breath, and it helps. So keep breathing deep. Good, come back to a lunge position here. Step the back foot halfway in, back heel is down, on your exhale, lower the body onto the front leg. Holding. Breathe. Good. Step your back foot in. Then again, hands on shins. Come to that flat back. Pressing the shoulders away from the ears, filling the length. Inhale, arms all the way up. Exhale, now step wide. Step wide. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, fold over again with the straddle legs. Fill the length in your back. Stay here. Good. I want you to come back up. Inhale, arms up. We're going to turn this foot this way. Reach out and over. Triangle position. This will be our last pose right here. Reaching. You feel the nice stretch in the back of the front leg. Good. And up. Inhale, arms up. Exhale. Open. Open this top shoulder up as best you can. Looking up or down, either way. Holding and breathe. Deep breath. Good. Come back up. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, hands to heart center. Step the feet in. And then I want you to have a seat. Just a comfortable position here to breathe. So bring your focus into your breath as you breathe in and out. In again and out. I hope these stretches help you feel better during your day during your work day, take a moment and do some deep breathing. Do some of the hip stretches and the shoulders and some of the strength. 
and be grateful for your ability and your breath and your life. Namaste. Thank you for coming.